Okay, so are you, are you ready? Uh, I guess. Mm -hmm. So uh, let's start with part one. So what kind of advertisement do you offer Mark today? Mm, to be honest, I'm not easily watch the other time, but um, mm, whenever I I set the uh, website, um, it really has the, like, the pops up other times uh, randomly appear and um, I feel it a uh, little annoying. But, um, uh, so, have you ever bought something because of its advertisement? Um, no, I'm not because um, I'm not usually um, like, uh, shopping online because I don't have money. But um, when I watch the uh, commercial about um, some product, and I think I will set the money to buy it, but I. <coughs> So, what do you think that we have so many advertisements nowadays? Mm, I was trying to know that you bring so many benefits to the colonies. Uh, it um, can approach um, potential um, customer can push uh, colony sales and it can make a lot of profit. In at in the order in the order is uh, uh can easy easy to make so so what about the customer do they have any benefits from advertising mm, they can know about the product mm -hmm. so. After that, when you know more about, when the customer know information about the product, so what what are the benefits for them? Um, they can decide if they uh, um, if they need to buy it or not. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's move to part two. You have one minute to prepare and two minutes to talk about that. So. Describe an advertisement you remember well, or describe your favorite advertisement. You have one minute to take notes, and after that, you have two minutes to talk. So I will count the time. Okay, time is up. So now you have two minutes to talk about your favorite advertisement. Um, so. My favorite advertisement is uh, the Saudi Alzheimer's which uh, invite Ronaldo to become the uh, brand endorsement. Um, in, in, um, to be honest, uh, I'm a big fan of Ronaldo <coughs> and when I, uh, uh, when I first uh, saw this, I was I um, was very impressed um, because um, now I can watch Ronaldo's um, speak uh, speak in English, uh, in Vietnamese uh, with the slogan "More than Stop Me." I find um, kind of uh, entertaining. Um, um, so this commercial is uh, getting viral so quickly. Um, so I guess this commercial uh, will um, uh, can approach uh, the potential customer like uh, um, who who is a Ronaldo fan. Can make a lot of profit and boost uh, comedy sales because of the Ronaldo reputation. Okay, so did you buy any products 
when Ronaldo is uh, the ambassador for for Sharpie? Do um, I any product because of him? Yes, and um, in when they uh, invite Ronaldo to became the brand endorsement, is that the like the super sell is uh, like sell fifty percent of every single product in the uh, particular town and by Wait to wait to that time and buy some product that um, uh, affordable. Mm -hmm. Do you remember what product you buy? Mm, like I buy a cup which has the Ronaldo face on it. Mm -hmm. Cup, right? Okay, so now, now let's go to part three. So, do you think advertisement has a good or bad influence on children? Um, I think it's depending on which girl comes for it. Uh, which comes for it, um, children watch, uh, like, um, if they watch the adult advertisement like beer or Walker home and you know, this was like very bad for children and the opposite is when it, um, when children watch some commercial and um, approximate uh, uh, approximately their age like study or toy I think that will be benefit. Uh, how do they benefit them? Like in how educational advertisement benefit them? Like if there's a cartoon that have the uh, education educational um, stories, like yeah, that like story, and I think they will more like. Education because they have some uh, lovely Catholic character and they will study like it and they love it. <laughs> okay, so maybe they have some like lesson you can learn from the story. Okay, so the last one. So, do you think that how we can control the advertisement nowadays? Mm. Or in other words, what, what we can do to control the advertising and the Like control. Yeah. Um, control. I think uh, control. Uh, like, and you can see that there are some fake news or some false information was given in advertising. So, how we can control that? Um, or how we can control like adult advertisement to children. Do you have something to avoid that? Um, I think it's the end uh, um, to avoid children to watch adult uh, advertisement. I think we need to um, adjust the time level of um, the adult advertisement on to the uh, uh, like different time that she would on on that go to school or sleep mm -hmm. to avoid them to watch the other side. Okay, so thank you. What is the end of your speaking?